Welcome back to McPhee Ford, and today we're taking a look at this brand new 2021 Ford Escape Titanium Hybrid. This Escape is painted in a gorgeous velocity blue. Looks really, really good on this hybrid. You've also got the uh, roof rails up there too. Let's take a look at what the titanium trim offers. You do have intelligent access door handles, remote entry keypad. You do have your blind spot on the mirrors there. Ambient lighting on the insides here, which is nice to have. You've got memory seating, power window controls, power mirror controls. You also get the Bang & Olufsen sound system built into here, which sounds really, really good. Full leather interior here for all around the seats. Power lumbar, power seats for both driver and passenger. On the left here, you do have trunk release, gas cap release, lighting controls, and your dimming. Getting into the interior, let's go ahead and push the button up. LED headlights up front. And you get your nice ready to drive function here because it's a hybrid. You do have a few different screens in here. This is very customizable. This is your digital display here where you can get audio. You can go through your audio settings, navigation. You can go to my home, points of interest. You got phone settings as well if you were to have one connected here. You also have vehicle settings. So you got brake crouch, neutral tow. Um, on the steering wheel here itself, you do have adaptive cruise, link keep assist, and cruise control. And then on the back of here, you have hands-free uh, calling. You do also will notice you do have your power in kilowatts reading on the display here, which is really cool to see. Sync 3 sound system here, where you do have a fully working navigation system. You can zoom in and out no problem. You've got search functions, so you can search for history, your home, favorites, anything like that. Live traffic is available too. You've got audio with satellite radio. Sirius XM is built in here. You can download various apps. You also have a power flow. You can read your power flow reading here, which is cool to see. Uh, Sirius XM travel link. So this is where you can do like your subscription info. You can check fuel prices of different places, um, etc. You've also got a comm screen button there, which is cool to see. Moving over to the settings, you've got driver's assistance. This is fully loaded here. You've got the cruise control, lane keep, pre-collision, si uh, speed sign recognition, review camera, park aid, blind spot, grade assist, drive alert. Really drive the car for you, honestly. It's really nice to see. You've got dual zone climate here with heated seats and a heated steering wheel function. Digital uh, numbers on the side here. Also changes up on the screen, too. Below that, you've got a... 12 volt outlet here on the side with two USB ports. Ambient lighting continues on in the center console here with the cup holders lit up, which is really cool. Looks nice at nighttime. Your shift lever, electric parking brake, brake hold, and various drive modes. The uh, display will change with the drive mode, so if you get sport, slippery, it all changes color. It's dynamic. Looks really nice. Add a nice little added feature here, actually, uh, to this Escape. Beside that is your Parking assist, so you can do uh, parking to parallel park, the car will park itself for you. You've also got your, beside here is your perimeter parking sensors. You've also got a cup holder, or a center console, sorry. Lots of space in here, you can put extra change, wallet, keys, whatever you want to put in there. Now coming around to the back of the Escape Titanium, you do have your rear park sensors along the back bumper here which is cool to see. You have your rear view camera right above the license plate. Open the trunk, you press the button once and the trunk will come up for you. Lots of space in the back of these escapes here. You've got an under storage with a spare tire and more storage under there. You've got spare floor mats here. The back seats can fold down too to increase, increase your storage greatly. Uh, you have a 12 volt outlet back here. So you want to charge anything or plug anything into maybe a light or a vacuum or anything like that, you can go ahead and do that close the trunk you just have the button up here the trunk will close for you and getting into the back now you do have cubbies on the doors here you have a little cup holder built in here rubber flooring on the ground which is nice easy to clean leather seating does continue into the back seats these back seats are easy to fold down you just pull the lever and it folds itself down you've got nice storage up front here if you want to any of your passengers want to store anything you've got two Fans here you can direct for uh, cooling or heat. And you've got two USB ports just over here for USB-C and USB-A. Center console armrest folds down with built-in cup holders, which is really 
convenient for your rear passengers. And then you've also got grab handles and dome lights on the top of the roof uh, for your rear passengers to hold on to or if they need to see anything at nighttime. And then as we make our way up to the front of the Escape, you'll also notice you do have your nice 19-inch rims here on Bridgestones. Really good in the winter with these tires. Uh, you have your LED lighting system up front, high beams, low beams, and fog lights. Nice front grill here. The Escape was really recently redesigned in 2020, but for the 21 model year, it pretty much stays the same. So make sure to come on over to McPhee Ford to get your hands on this Escape Titanium Hybrid. Uh, as always, thank you for watching. Feel free to subscribe, and we'll see you in our next video.